What's up, everybody? My name is Richard Blade. Thank you guys so much for 250 subscribers. All right. The number may be a little give or take right now, but it's official. We hit 250 subscribers at some point recently, and I want to say thanks a lot. So I went to my Facebook page, and I asked you guys what I should do for my next Let's Watch. And you guys voted. We're watching The Room. That's right. Tommy Wiseau's The Room. What is infamously known as one of the worst and or best movies of all time. So yeah, I've never seen this movie, but I do know of its legacy. I mean, I've seen the reviews, I watched Nostalgia Critic, I ate everything, I've seen them, and I know how infamously terrible this film is. So yeah, got uh, got my pot brownies here. <laughs> I, um, I have some candy here, and I have a nice cold drink here. So I'm ready to sit down and enjoy myself. We're gonna have a good time. <laughs> all right. So, without further ado, this is The Room. Let's get started. All right. So the movie will begin in three, two, one. Wizzo Films. Are there uh, any other movies out there from Wizzo Films? Chloe Productions, TPW Films presents a Wizzo Films production. The only one they ever made, as far as I know. The Room. The Room. The Room. Starry Tommy Wiseau. <laughs> Craig Sestero. Never heard of him. That's not a good sign. <laughs> This movie had three executive producers, are you serious? Only one writer, that's not surprising. <laughs> the hands not even started yet, and I'm already starting to laugh at the idea of watching this shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, is it here? Here it is, is it here? Hi, babe. I have something for you. Terrible acting. Just a little something. Terrible dialogue. <laughs> terrible writing. Terrible film. Terrible everything. <laughs> you know, I first when I first heard about this movie, I thought that was a wig. But as I, I looked it up, it turns out that's his real hair. He really that's his wow, real hair you there. Wow, look so sexy, Lisa. I would do anything for my girl. His mouth didn't even ma match the oh, words hey there. Hey, I just uh, walked into your house mind. without knocking. Cause I just do that. I'm going to take a nap. Can I go upstairs too? <laughs> Denny, I think I'm gonna join him. <laughs> He's so disappointed. He's like, I wanted to take a nap with him. That just sounds so weird here. And he goes upstairs with him because that's not creepy at all. What was Tommy thinking when he was directing the scene? Okay, we're gonna have a pillow fight. <laughs> then this weird kid's gonna jump on top of us. Hey. Stop, no, stop. <laughs> Is this not the most awkward thing ever? I just like to watch you guys. Yeah, cause that's not creepy at all. Denny, Denny, Denny boy. <laughs> that's not creepy. Denny, two's great, but three's a crowd. <laughs> um, unless you're into that sort of thing. I get it. You guys wanna be alone. That's yeah, the idea. That's what they said earlier. <laughs> that's what we said earlier. <laughs> this is so awkward. Like, it just feels so awkward, this whole thing. Like, it's like... <laughs> it's such a, it's such an uncomfortable feeling, like... I mean, like, it's making me laugh, but like... You know... <laughs> it's, it's so uncomfortable, in a sense, you know? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to cut this part out. We can't watch this. Instead, you're gonna have to stare at my face the whole time. <laughs> Just, the, just watch this beautiful face reacting to this terrifying sex scene. Uh, I should probably just eat a brownie really slowly and sexually while I do this. We're only six minutes in so far, and this is uh, what we're getting. I know you guys can't see this, but I'm kind of hoping my mom doesn't come walking to the door and see this, because this is going to be really awkward to say. 
It's like, honey, what are you watching? I'm, I'm reviewing porn for YouTube, Mom. Get out. <laughs> I didn't think there'd actually be nudity in this. <laughs> I really didn't think there was nudity in this. At least as far as I knew. Like, first sex scene, I thought it was, like, pretty censored. Like, pretty tame. Nope. I saw a tit. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, fuck my belly button. <laughs> Turn this Audi into an innie. <laughs> It's too awkward sounding, I can't. Like, it's just... Ugh. It's not even real sex, it's just... Okay, it's, it's not thinking... Yeah, we're good now. <laughs> it just got too much for me, guys, I'm sorry. I don't want to get up, I don't want to act, I don't want to be in this shitty movie, I just want to leave. And there it is, the money shot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tommy Wiseau may not have much uh, shame, but, uh, I mean, do we really need that ass shot of you? <laughs> did you like last night? Yes, I did. <laughs> you know, Tommy isn't the only bad actor in this mm -hmm. movie. This girl's not good either. Go there's not much. There's not a lot okay. of emotion coming out of her. Bye. She's very dull, too. Like, so it's not just Tommy. I mean, Tommy's is legendary. His performance is bad, but hers is kind of just bad. Like, it's just so lifeless. Tommy is something special. Oh, hang on, I don't like this. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, I thought it was the scene where the kid I'm comes fine. back in. How are you? But it's the mom. Hmm? I don't love him anymore. Why don't you love him anymore? Tell me. He's so boring. Well, you've known him for over five years. You're, you're one to talk. He's so lifeless. He supports you. He provides for you. He's a wonderful man, and he loves you very much. And he told me he plans to buy you a house. That's why he's so boring. Well, what are you going to do? Like, what are you looking for? Yeah, he bought you a car. He bought you a ring, clothes, whatever you wanted. Now you want to dump him. That's not right. I know, right? It sounds like, she sounds, she sounds like a complete unlocked. bitch. Like, I don't understand why she doesn't love him. I mean, they just had sex yesterday. last night. Why would you I'm have sex with someone you didn't love? To your mother. Unless you're a prostitute, but to me. this isn't a prostitute. You're probably right about that, Mom. But you remember what I told you, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll be back in my 20 minutes so we can have the same conversation again later in the movie. Thanks, Mom. Again, no life. Like, people like to shit all over Tommy Wiseau, but at least his performance is enjoyable. Hello? This this chick is just hey, dead inside. Oh, hey, look, we'll talk about Can it later. Be. I told you I'm very busy. We'll talk about it now. Whenever you say we'll talk about it later, we <laughs> never do. I want to talk about it now. I want to talk right now. You owe me one anyway. Okay. I'm like, bitch, right, I'm working. What do you talk about? I'm sorry. I'd be like, Stupid bitch, I'm working. I'm sorry. To Gotta go. Life. Can I see you tomorrow? Okay. All right, how about noon? I'll be waiting for you. He's up. Uh, All right, see ya. He's really quick to, you know, be ready to go meet her tomorrow. Like, he doesn't suspect anything at all. It's just that if a girl were to say, can you come over tomorrow or something like that, I kind of get the idea something's up. Like, you know, maybe she's into me or something. Like, I'm not an idiot. Yeah, he's still not getting it. It's so... <laughs> I'm sorry, the audio is so weird. It's like, it's so dead silent in one headset. And when the liquid started pouring, it came in the other headset. I'm like, it kind of like... Um... Do you mind? No. Wow, this is like the most innocent guy ever. He's like, <laughs> it's like you gotta like he takes hints. Like this guy's like a fucking brick wall. You can't drop hints with this guy. You just gotta fucking you gotta legit sit on his dick and let him fucking get it. I arrived there. I mean the candles, the music, the 
the sexy dress? I mean, what's going on here? What do you think, idiots? <laughs> like, what are you, dumbass? I like you very much. Lover boy. Duh. What are you doing this for? What do you think? What's the matter? Dumbass. Johnny's my best friend. All right, you're gonna be married. Yeah, I'm glad time. we. Uh, I'm glad we got to establish that shit earlier in the movie. Like I said, I've seen the reviews for this movie before, so like I remember not hate everything review of this movie. Like he describes her as supposed to be like the most so. evil woman in the world, yeah, but the her. problem is she has no motivation. Please like don't they don't establish please well please. why she doesn't like Johnny. They don't establish why she's doing this you. at all. I don't want to get married anymore. So it it's just. Like Johnny. It just doesn't make a lot of sense why she's being this horrible to Johnny. It doesn't make any sense at all. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. I need you to make love to me. And this time in the pussy, not in the fucking oh, belly button. I love how he just said he, everything's gonna be fine. He pretty much said no, but now here he is just giving in. He's like, I won't do it. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I won't do it. Mm. No, you can't make me do it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> and we're gonna get another really cringe-worthy sex scene that you guys aren't gonna ever see. Like I said, normally I wouldn't give a shit about showing you guys this shit, but one, it's so bad I don't think I should show you guys, and B, I know YouTube would get in my ass for it. I promise, I'm not as boring to stare at when I'm uh, watching porn, I promise. <laughs> so yeah, when I'm watching porn, I'm usually a lot more excited. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> why are they doing it on the staircase? Like, why was the staircase the place to do this? There's a bed upstairs. Like, this, is, this makes about as much sense as doing it on a kitchen counter. When the bedroom's right over there. Yeah, yeah, reach in there. Yeah, fingers, butthole. <laughs> uh, what the fuck am I watching? This is so fucking weird. Oh, uh, if you, only you guys could see this. Oh, uh, if only you guys could see this shit. I can't do this. I can't. It's over. Thank God. Why did you do this to me? You had every right to say no. You know, the whole say no rule doesn't just apply to women, it applies to men too. This feels more like, um... This feels more like scenes for a really well done movie. But they didn't want to do anything else between it. They didn't want to set up a character, they didn't want to set up arcs. They just wanted to show the good stuff. The good, heavy, dramatic stuff without doing the other stuff that's just as important as the heavy stuff. Like, like when Steven's universe has its Steven bombs, the reason why they're so effective, like, actual bombs, is because we know those characters, we know the story, we know all that stuff. That's what makes it so effective. This feels like a Steven bomb without anything else, like just random events. You don't know anything, how is this effective? Yeah, can I have a dozen red roses, please? Oh, hi, Johnny, I didn't know it was you. Here you go. That's me. How much oh is it? Gosh. It'll be $18. Here you go. Keep the change. Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bye-bye. Wow, that was... <laughs> that was the uh, most cringeworthy scene ever. Like, what? Yeah. That scene was on fast forward, five, man. Five, five, four, eight, it was like eight. It was like reversed, too, of all things. Half bacon with pineapple, half artichoke with pesto and light on the cheese. And while you're at it, how about some uh, life so I can give this performance a uh, C-minus performance. Thank you. I'm so Who good, I'm gonna get an Oscar. Really? Oh my god, here it is. I love this scene so doing? much. How are you doing? I'm fine. You look beautiful today. Can I kiss you? You are such a little brat. <laughs> what?! Kidding. I love you and Johnny. Okay, okay. Oh my Johnny's god. I fucking wait. love this scene so much. I gotta go. Let's so tell me stop by. Of course I will. This kid's such a weird kid. Like, is he supposed to be mentally challenged? Is that the joke? Like, I legit, like, I think... I think the kid's supposed to be, like, mentally disabled or something. Like, to show how great of a character Johnny is. You know, because he adopted this mentally disabled kid. But Hi, they babe. don't establish that he's mentally disabled. For you. 
We're just led to assume. Yep, he's Thanks mentally handicapped. Beautiful. That's why he's so freaking weird. Did you get your promotion? Nah. I'm such a nice guy too. I don't know what happened. I don't even know what job I work at. <laughs> I just have a job. <laughs> What's the matter? You all right? It's Why are you asking him that? She just said he didn't you know get a promotion. Mean? He feels used. She's like, bitch, you going to drink? And we're gonna have cheap, meaningless sex, and then I'm gonna continue to tell people you don't love me, and I don't love you for some reason. Don't bother asking why I'm gonna do it. Just assume that I'm a cold, heartless bitch. Come on, make love to me. Oh. Come on, you owe me one. And this time, not in the belly button. I love you, Lisa. That's what this feels like. So I feel like this I is just some party. real Early shitty thing that for time it was out again some chick's pants. When is it? Nobody wants to help me, and I'm dying. You're not dying, Mom. You're dying? I got the results of the test back. I definitely have breast cancer. Yikes! Look, don't worry about it. Everything will be fine. Mm. You're carrying lots of people every day. I'm sure I'll be all right. You are. I. I, I don't know the exact number, but about. it's like a really high number. A, a lot well, of people so die from cancer. Town. It's a very serious thing. Don't worry about it. And this you film is treating cancer like about. it's no big deal. Well, mom, he's not what you think he is. He doesn't know he how his sex his works. And he got drunk last night. And he hit me. Right in the belly button. Johnny doesn't drink. What are you talking about? <laughs> Hello, he did last night. Uh, Johnny is your financial security. You can't afford to ignore We've it. had this conversation yeah, okay, already. Man. Can I just talk to you later? I look forward to the same conversation later in the movie. <clears throat> okay, who are these guys? Let's have some fun. Yeah, this is a porno. This you, uh, this is a yeah. porno. All right, That's this is how porn it. works. Okay, no one cares about the story. <laughs> no one cares about the acting. And now we have two random people we haven't even met yet who are now just having sex in t in Johnny's house for no reason. This is a porno. It just happens to be the worst porno ever. Chocolate is a symbol of love. Who are you people? Plus, I mean a fucking chocolate brownie. I mean M and M's. Where's my love? I want love. Not from these weirdos. I mean this this is fucking weird. It's awkward as fuck. He's like, oh, chocolate chip, my favorite. <laughs> what are these characters doing here? They like to come here to. Oh, do that's a good question. Homework. What homework? Johnny found him a little apartment here in this building, and he's paying for it until he graduates from school. I know, Johnny's Johnny such really a nice guy. Danny, even though he doesn't say it much. He's like a father figure to him. I told you, Mom, Johnny is very caring about the people in his life. And he gave Denny his own set of keys to our place. I'm sorry, I thought you said that he's Please, just a terrible man who gets Johnny. drunk and beats now, people. If you really don't love him, so be it. But you should tell him. We're at okay. the half hour mark, guys. And so far, all we've seen is really bad sex, really bad acting, and two conversations of the same kind be done before. Oh That's my God. all we've fucking seen so far. Uh-oh. It's some random guy. You know what? I haven't got five fucking minutes! I'm gonna ask you again, Denny. Where's my money? I don't have anything. Where's my money, Denny? Where's my fucking money, Denny? <laughs> Did you oh, look. fucking money? Oh look, someone is actually acting. Coming. I'm surprised. Where's my fucking money, Danny? Put the gun down. My fucking money! Where's my fucking okay, money, Danny? Fucking... Dude, that is a Dude, that is a fucking oh, stupid God, thing to do. Let's take him to the police. Oh, fucking dead! What do you need money for? Mom, please, Denny's with me and Johnny! A man like Yes, that. shut up! I'll interrogate him! Oh, I bought some drugs off of him. Things got mixed up. I didn't mean for this to happen. <laughs> I don't have them anymore. What kind of drugs, Denny? It doesn't matter. I don't have them the anymore. The bad kind. It doesn't matter. How in the hell did you get involved with drugs? Uh, what were you giving them to him? Selling them to him? Where in the hell did you meet that man? Yeah, he was selling drugs the drugs. That's why she's, he's asking like for the that. money, dumbass. What is wrong with you? Money. How much? Stop ganging up on 
me. Well, it is time somebody ganged up on you, for God's sake. A man like that. Where in the hell did you meet a man God, like that? God, this is such it a shit show, matter. guys. It matters a great deal. A man holds a gun on you, you almost got killed. You expect me to forget that. Huh? You're not my fucking mother. You listen no, to me, no, old boy. No. Somebody had better so do funny. something around here. <laughs> This is so fucking weird. Are you okay, Danny? I'm okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. What's clear? I am going to call the police. Mom, stop. It was Denny's mistake. Just stop. Oh. Let's go. Yeah, Mom, just Why let it go, you okay? You know better, right? I'm so Why? I'm sorry. You know better, Denny. You almost got killed. I'm sorry. This it won't so happen again, fucking... I promise. Denny, yeah, because that's, how, like that's how taking drugs works. He just apologizes and he'll never take it again. I mean, there's no such thing as a Let's drug addict, on. right? Is Johnny there? He's in the shower. I don't understand you. Why do you do things like this? Because I yeah, why are you calling another man while your husband's or your fiance is right in the other room? I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hey, Johnny. What's up? I have a problem with Lisa. I don't have to worry about that because Lisa is loyal to me. Yeah, man, you never know. People are very strange these days. Why don't you just? Oh, why don't you just say? A dozen guys. Yeah. One of them found out about it, beat her up so bad she ended up in a hospital on Guerrero Street. <laughs> what a story, Mark. Yeah, you can say that again. <laughs> Assault is hilarious. I'm so happy I have you as my. Well, maybe you should. Why does he just own up to the fact and say Lisa tried to have sex with me? Yeah. He, I mean, he doesn't have to say yeah, he had sex right. with her. Just say. Well, what happened? Remember Betty? That's her name? Betty? Wow, that was yeah. terribly a yard. His yeah, mouth didn't even move half the time there. That was so you know, bad. She wasn't any good in bed. She was beautiful, but we had too many arguments. That's that was bad. another really bad a yard moment there. I can get it. Oh, man. I just can't figure women out. Sometimes they're just too smart. Sometimes it's it's obviously stupid. a different microphone. Nothing, man. Do you? Do you have some secrets? Forget it. Why don't you talk? Why? Forget it, dude. Is it some secret? Tell no, me. forget it. I'll talk to you later. Well, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> There's just this awkward aurora aura all over this fucking movie. It's hey, so Johnny. bad. Oh, hi, Danny. What's wrong with Mark? He's cranky today. <laughs> Girl, Stop laughing at their things, you weirdo. What's new with you? Not much. Drugs. Still going to the movie tonight? It's about Lisa. Go on. She's beautiful. She looks great in a red dress. I think I'm in love with her. Go on. I, I know she doesn't like me, but sometimes she's mean to me. Sometimes when I'm around her. Thanks for paying my tuition. You're very welcome, Danny. And keep in mind, if you have any How much money does Tommy make to pay a college you? tuition? Awesome. Like, Jesus. Thanks, Johnny. Either it's Let's the cheapest college Tom. ever, or on, Tommy is literally Tommy. just made of fucking money. I'm starving. <laughs> I know I just called him Tommy instead of Johnny, but you get it, right? Like, you know who I'm talking about. Oh, is that the girl who, uh... Is he disappointed? Had sex earlier? Quite a bit. The girl who he just appeared out of night. fucking nowhere? And he hit me. He hit you? He didn't I love how she's anything. the one who reacts properly. Are you okay? Well, I don't want to marry him anymore. What? Johnny's... Like, how come you don't want to marry someone who hits you? But I found you bitch. Else. Well, if you care so much for him, why cheat on him? Yeah. Look, I really don't know what to do. Not I cheat on him. him. Break up with him like a real good person. Friends. Stop being a cold, heartless, evil person for no reason. Spreading. Have a motivation, why don't you? You've got to tell Johnny. No guilt trips. You don't feel guilty about this at all. No. I'm happy. She's a cold, heartless bitch! Something. Oh, we just need to keep emphasizing the fact that she's a bad person. She's cheating on Johnny. And it's terrible. There you go. That's what I think about this movie so far. <laughs> How dare you talk to me like that? You should tell me everything. Okay, well, you just pushed her, so you technically did hit her. You are lying. I never hit you. It's like, you are well, you did push it. You are tearing me apart, Lisa. Why <laughs> there it is. Do you understand life? You just hit Do her again. You? Don't worry about it. Everything will be all right. You drive me crazy. Good night, Johnny. Don't worry about it. I still love you. 
Good night, Lisa. Yeah, because this is how real people talk. There's not much for me to say at this point. Like, I kinda, I kinda need to think about what I wanna say about this movie. Like, it's a movie that is so... flawed in every hey, frame oh, hi, Mike. What's that I'm legitimately like, I, I don't know Actually, what to say about it. Like, I got, I got a little bit of I gotta go see Michelle in a little bit to make out with her. Oh, so I'm sorry. Come on. Yeah, cause that's all men do. Oh, that's all women are good for. Sex and stuff. Am I right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. boy stuff. Yeah, sorry you had to see that. I'm not sorry. <laughs> this set is the worst, by the way. The background. It's so fake looking. Like shit, man. I don't study like that. Like shit, it's the worst. <laughs> hey, Jenny, what's hey, what's up, up Mark? Oh, hi, Mark. Catch it. Hey, man, I'm here for the football game. Hey, oh, I'm just here I'm because. Why not? <laughs> this is so. Like, this is just so weird. It's so odd. It's just such a. Take that, bitch. Because we just did that. You literally just gut punched him with a football. Anytime, all right? Okay. All right? Yeah. See you guys. That was so odd. Like, what the fuck just happened? Let's go home, Danny. Like, we're playing football, that guy came- Mark came in, got punched the guy with a football, and then they'll leave. Like, what?! I didn't get away. Mom, I don't love Johnny anymore. I don't even oh, like him. Really? I had sex with Wow, I did not know that. You can't be serious. I'm glad you're telling me this for the first you're time ever. I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it. Why would you bring it up then if you didn't want to talk about it? It's like I'm sleeping with somebody. Who? I don't you want to don't talk about know. it. We're only at the halfway mark, guys. Like, this movie, we're at the 50 minute mark. And yeah, this film still has, like. How can it's like. Say this about it's only halfway done, too. I don't believe it. Fuck. I show them. I don't want to sound mean, but Tommy Wiseau looks like he's had surgery on his face. Like, is that a thing that happened? Like. Like, he's got, like, that line on his fucking side there, like on his right side of his face, and it just looks weird. Like, I can't tell if it's a vein or a scar, or like, did he have surgery in the past? I don't know. Sorry. You know what they say, love is blind. I got not faith in Lisa. I don't see what that saying has to do with the situation. Like complicated. When you, you say love is blind, happen. it's like, she's a cheating whore though. Like, when it does, we just gotta deal with it. I don't know. For me, you if you cheat once, it's yeah. over. I don't give a shit. No second chances. It's over. We're done. All right. That's just me. Hey, Peter. Oh, hey, man. I'm here just Talking because. Talking about women. It's like, oh god, you're talking about women. I thought you'd be talking about dudes. Women. I came to talk about dudes. <laughs> like you know, oh. football and. Beer and I have a girl. sports and stuff. She's married. I mean, she <laughs> chicken, Peter. You just a little chicken. Cheep, 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 cheep. Who are you calling a chicken? I just don't like all the weirdos. There's too many weirdos there. It's like, who, like, why are you I calling me a blonde. chicken? I have done nothing Smart to dude, prompt dude, that insult whatsoever. The blonde one. I just want you and Johnny to be happy. I am happy. Look, Denny. Do you hear me, little shit? Happy. I am happy. I'll see you later. Am I wrong? What? What are you? It's like, I'll, it's like I'll kill you. I'll throw you over this two feet plate, like this fucking Play-Doh brick. Sorry. Sorry, man. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, we'll forget about I'm you almost killing me, <laughs> like a sure, real okay, human would. Man. I'm so depressed. It's all her fault. She's such a manipulative bitch. How the hell did you let this happen? I know, right? You know this is good. Well, at least someone understands. Whoa. Hey guys. Oh, he shaved. You like it? Yeah. He doesn't look like a fucking hippie he anymore. <laughs> he looks like a baby. Mark, go. Go. Oh. <laughs> Gee, Peter, you're clumsy. All right, that's Let's all just get on his back and just idea, stare at him. <laughs> it's so weird. This film isn't even human. It's like an alien made this movie. I swear, an alien made this movie. An alien wrote it. An alien directed it. I swear, an alien made this. I, I, I'm getting a headache trying to wrap my head around every little thing with this movie. Like, the humans don't interact the way humans do. The writing is terrible. The acting is dreadful. Like, I, I get it now. This is just such a fucking abysmally made film. Like, it's... 
I mean, it's it's curious. It's, it's interesting to see how horrible it is made. Cheesecake. Relationships never work. I don't know why I waste my time. What makes you say that? It's not that easy, Johnny. Well, you should be happy, Mark. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Life is too short. Oh, oh thank you, gosh. You're welcome. We're just getting the same conversations cheesecake. over and oh, over and over so again. Good. That's all it is. Oh. Women are the worst. Women cheat. How Women suck. Oh, Relationships good. We got a new client. And Love bank, sucks. It's we'll just... A lot of money. God, it's getting what frustrating client? and annoying. I cannot tell you. It's confidential. Oh, come on. Why not? No, I can't. Anyway, how is your sex life? <laughs> can't talk about it? <laughs> Who the fuck would just randomly come up and say, How is your sex life? Oh, Already? Like, yeah, yeah, fuck. Sorry. It's so sorry. weird. Sorry. Yeah. I like you very much, Mark. Oh, come on. Johnny's my best friend. Just one more time. <laughs> For someone who doesn't want to do this, he's really easily manipulated to do this shit, isn't he? Yep, the headphones come off. I don't care. I mean, like, it's like every time a conversation repeats itself, it's just like... It's like, like, okay, we gotta talk about how much women suck, or we gotta talk about how much to Johnny uh, technically abuses Lisa and all that shit. It's literally the same conversations, like, repeated over and over and over again. Like, each and every one of them. We have one conversation where Lisa doesn't like Johnny anymore. We have one conversation with Mark here not wanting to sleep with Lisa, and yet here he is sleeping with Lisa right now. We have a conversation where Tommy's trying to figure out why Lisa's being such a heartless, cold bitch to him. We have a conversation where... You know, Mark and Tommy are trying to talk when even th when fucking when fucking like they make it so obvious that Mark's obviously sleeping with Lisa and Tommy's just being a fucking idiot. Like it's the same shit over and over again. Every fucking one of the conversations is the same thing. It really is. Wow. So uh, you gonna be ready? How do you mean that? I'm always ready for you. I mean for the party. Is that all women think about? Time. Having sex with men? All I have to do is put on my Getting with dress. men? Is that all women think about? Come on. Wait, 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 what are you doing? Nothing. This woman's a fucking pervert, I'm sorry. And don't say women can't be perverts, they are totally perverts. We literally had a sex with these two just like two minutes ago. You guys didn't see it, but I'm serious. You guys are too much. <laughs> You're cheating on your fiance and breaking his heart at the same time. And when he finds out, he's going to be very self-destructive. <laughs> so charming. So charming, you women. <laughs> We're cheating! We're such terrible people. The coffee table. Okay. So bad. This is not how real women what are. What are you doing here? Like, even women who do cheat, they're like, fuck. <laughs> I don't think zipper? they're like this. At least I hope they're not like this. What about his zipper? You know, I really loved Johnny at first. Again, we're having this conversation again. Changed. This is the same conversation from really before. Can give me. Suddenly my eyes are wide open and I can see everything so clearly. I want it all. <laughs> you think you can get it all from Mark? If he can't give me what I want, somebody else will. Lisa, you're sounding What a like fucking you're bitch! You're being so Again, she's such a heartless, so what, care, careless person. What the fuck? You look, I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, you know what? You know what? Apparently, nobody wants to talk about anything in this movie, do they? We have to finish. Because that would actually, uh, you know, involve character development, wouldn't it? I don't see what to the deal is. This, this is so fucking awful. Like, it's just the writing. In the, yeah, it's just. Right. Yeah. It's just so... It's so awkward. The dialogue doesn't even feel remotely real. These people don't feel remotely real. It's just... It's a mind-boggler. Like, it gives you a headache trying to think about it. And try, it's not trying to figure out how this all works. Because I'm in love with Mark, not Johnny. And here I am, planning his party. It's not right, Lisa. Johnny's okay, I suppose. What? The fuck? Actually, I have him wrapped around my little finger. Well, you should be happy then. But I don't love him. <sighs> well, what the fuck? It's like it's like a it's like a drive-by scene. Like, 
I don't like, know. she comes in because she invited him. They have the same conversation, and then she has to go for some reason. Like, like that's not how it works. Like, people aren't like this. Like, it's just... Like, it's like Tommy was trying to make this these, like, women look like the worst things ever. And it makes... It's like Johnny's supposed to be the greatest thing ever. And women are just the worst thing ever. It's like, it's like a really... It's got like a really sexist agenda against it for it. He doesn't yeah. suspect a thing for some reason. I don't understand why he doesn't suspect a thing. I guess uh, they're gonna run off and have sex somewhere because that's all couples do. Apparently, they just have sex. That's all hot studs and hot chicks do, right? They just have sex, <laughs> nothing else. Are you fucking serious? Are you that dumb? You're really gonna try to have sex with somebody and cheat on your fiance so, uh, at his fiance's birthday at her at your fucking fiance's birthday party? It's a surprise. You're such a fucking idiot. <laughs> You're just begging for trouble at this point. What are you doing? I mean, are you crazy? Everybody's here. I know. Not. <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> and they could come back in at any minute to grab a snack you or a drink. You didn't think the plan. Well, what's going on here? Through. Yeah, see, just like that. Why are you doing this? Who the fuck are you? I love him. I don't believe it. Like, who the fuck are you? Do you understand what you're doing? You're going to destroy Johnny. He's very. Who are you? Sensitive. I don't care. I'm in love with Mark. How can you do this? You make me sick. It's like everyone knows how much of a bitch she is, but the movie's never gonna bring it up. Thank you, Hannah. This is a beautiful. It's never gonna explain why she's this way. Friends. It's like, oh, this woman's just a cold, heartless Welcome bitch. Darling. Why is she a heartless bitch? You know she I just have. is. I do. Like <laughs> that's not how people work. That's not how people work at all. No, it's getting. Like parts of this movie makes me want to laugh, and other parts of this movie is making me really sick. Hey everybody, I have an announcement to make. We're expecting. <laughs> you have got to be honest with Johnny. I agree with that. I'm like, who are you? I'm gonna I agree with that. I, just, I, don't I know. I, no, no one knows who I am, but when is yeah, the baby I agree with that. There is no baby. What? what? What are you talking about? Why would you say there's a baby? I told him that to make it interesting. Make well, what interesting? Because this is just getting worse and worse. I feel why? Like I'm yeah. sitting on an atomic bomb waiting for it to go off. Yeah, why the fuck would you even say There's that? No There's no reason to say to that don't shit. Worry. I don't want to talk about it. Lisa, you're going to have to face it. I don't want to talk about anything. I'm going to have a hard time forgiving you if you don't. It's like, I don't want to talk about it. I if I talk about it, Lisa. I actually have to have a motive. I have to talk about my character and have a motivation. And we can't have that at all, can we? I just have to be a cold, heartless bitch for no good reason. Okay. Whatever. Well, whose baby is it? Is it mine? No, of course not. How can you be sure? Come on, Lisa. Just stop asking me stupid questions. Who the hell do you think you are? Just shut up. What, what are you doing? What, what's going on here? You really don't know, do you? Maybe I know more than you think I do, Mark. Shit, all right? What do you want from me, huh? Time for a fight. All right. Really? Right there in front of everybody. They really don't care anymore. Don't spoil it. We were just having fun. Don't touch me, motherfucker. Get out. Stop it! Stop Keep it! My girl mom. Let's have a let's have a real fight. Why don't we? You two are acting like children. The one who's acting like a bitch. You're gonna ruin the party. To keep your girl satisfied, she will come to me. Get out my house. I kill you. I'll bring him in full of Stop it! I kill you. Bastard. What a shit show, guys. Betray me. You're not good. You. You're just a chicken. Chip, 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 chip. No, when he does that to me, call me a chicken, you bastard. It's not 
over. Everybody betrayed me. I fed up with this world. <laughs> Everyone in this movie's a fucking dumbass too. It's like she's dancing with she's obviously cheating on him and she's dancing with a guy who she's sleeping with cheating on with Johnny right in front of everybody. What kind of dumbass does that shit? <laughs> I remember this part from the Status Critics review. Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Don't worry about Johnny, he's just being a big baby. You're seriously you doing this when I'm right much. here. I can hear everything you're saying. Don't I'm tell me a party, sir. Who are you talking to? Nobody. We'll see about that. Why is he why is he even asking? The fuck? Like for real. He should know at this point. Like he for real had a fight with him. How could you do this to me? I gave you seven years of my life. And you betray me. We see what else we have in this state. No. Stop. You little prick. I put up with you for seven years. I think you're an angel. You're just like everybody. I treat you like a princess. He does. You me in the back. I love you and I did anything for you to just please you. Yeah, he you. did. And now you betray me. How could you love him? He... He's got a good point. Ditch this I don't like him anymore. Like, he has a good point. He's... Like, as horrible as the dialogue is, Johnny has been a really nice guy. As, at least as a character, that's what he was supposed to I guess that's what he's supposed to be. I'm angry. I'm mad. I'm going to break shit. I'm going to take all my anger on my possessions rather than the actual girl. Fuck this old ass TV that no one has anymore. Nah. Take that clothes. Take that cabinet. Fuck this bed. Fuck these sheets. Fuck these pillows. I will burn them. He's like, oh, oh, my dick. Oh, the STDs. Oh, that bitch gave me STDs too? And he's dead. Wake up, Johnny, come on. Wake up. It's fucking obvious he's dead, you dumbass. Is he dead? No, he's just sleeping with a fucking bullet wound in his mouth. Oh my god, Mark, is he dead? Oh, now you care, bitch. Now you fucking care. <laughs> Good night, sweet prince. <laughs> the fuck? Tramp. You killed him. You're the cause of all of this. It's true. I don't love you. Diddy, he's in a better place. <laughs> Leave us! Yes, I want to fuck his corpse, please. I love it. As far as I'm concerned, you can drop off the earth. That's a promise. Just leave, both of you. Come on, Curtis. Let's get a move on. The movie's over. Oh, now y'all are reacting to the gunshot that happened like five minutes ago. Like fuck, those two over there were fucking upstairs, and they they had to put their clothes on stuff and rush down to see what happened. That had to take a couple of minutes, and now everybody's reacting to the bullet. What the fuck? How many fucking cop cars are coming? At least one cop car. It's done. It's fucking done. I'm done. It's over. God, that was a fucking enigma. Like, like I um, like I can't put into words how I feel about this film. Like, I mean, like, like parts of it were hilariously awful. And other parts were just sickingly awful. Like, it's just like, how can someone have wrote and written this without being so fuckly, like, so mentally fucked up in the, in the head? Like, I can't, I can't even, I can't even begin to, I can't even begin to understand 
how this movie was written. I can't understand anything about this. Like how the people react, the acting, the writing, the effects. It's just, it just it's, a, it's an enigma of the mind. I, I feel like a villain from Batman's universe wrote this movie. Like, like the Riddler would watch this and think, I'm stumped. <laughs> like the Riddler would watch this and think he's stumped. I have I have no idea. I don't have a clue what the fuck this was. I have nothing to say. Like I just like it would take me time to try to like process what this movie was. Like I I can't begin to fathom what was going through Tommy Wiseau's mind when he wrote this. I mean like this film is literally just a repeat of every fucking thing. Like it it repeats itself so often. It's like just watching scene, the same scene over and over and over again. Like, we see a sex scene. We see the mom and Lisa. We see Tommy and Lisa. We see Mark and Lisa. We see Tommy and Mark. We see Tommy and Denny. It's just the same scene playing over and over and over and over again. Like, all throughout the movie. That is literally the entire movie until the birthday scene comes in. And then the last ten minutes are like a big fuck show. It's, that's all this fucking movie was. Just a complete shit show of what the fuckery. Like, it's it's almost impossible to... Like I said, it's just so fucking insane. I have no idea what to say about this movie. Ugh. I don't know. <laughs> I don't fucking know. My god, this was fucking shit. Like, I honestly, like... I guess the question of the day is, do I, what movie did I like better? Did I like The Room better, or did I like Cool Cat Saves the Kids better? I gotta be honest, I think Cool Cat Saves the Kids was better. Because, like, like, at least on a level of how a, a better, the bad movie, you know, like... Like, Cool Cat Saves the Kids was hilarious. Like, with The Room, I kind of... Um, this was the first time I ever sat through the entire film, but, like, I did know of this film's existence... But, like, unlike Cold Cat Saves the Kids, like, with The Room, like, everything bad about it was already talked about. So I kind of already knew everything that was coming. This was nothing new to me. So, like, I kind of already knew what was coming. Like, the scenes, like, that were the best of the, uh, of the entire movie, I already knew were coming. So it's like, you know, but with Cool Cat, like, there was so much to discover. Like, there was so much in Cool Cat that I did not expect. That's what made it so great. But uh, The Room, I kind of saw everything coming. And that's really what it was, like... Like, and plus, at least Cool Cat was original all the way through. Like, and when I say that, I mean, like, like, like I said, The Room is just the same conversation with these multiple characters on repeat. Like, you have one scene with Tom, with Tom or, like, not John Tommy, one scene with Johnny and Lisa, one scene with Lisa and the mom, Mark and Lisa, Lisa and, Tom, and Mark, like, like, Tommy and Lisa, Tommy and Denny, and that's the entire film all the way through. That's every scene in this fucking movie. With Cool Cat, at least it's a straight line. Like, at least it's nothing, re nothing repeats itself. It doesn't get annoying real quick. Well, I mean, okay, it gets annoying, but you get what I mean. Like, I don't know. I, I feel like I can sit down and watch Cool Cat Saves the Kids and get more out of it than I did with this movie. That's all I'm trying to say. <sighs> yeah, I'm done. <laughs> I'm fucking done with this. This was a shit show movie. I hated it. <laughs> wow. Um... So yeah, what did you guys think of The Room? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did you think it was amazingly awful or incredibly shitty? <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for watching. And again, thank you guys so much for 250 subscribers. That means a lot. Having 250 people, that's more than an entire classroom. I know math! Yay! <laughs> so yeah, thanks a lot guys. And as always, I'll see you in the next video, whatever I make. Stay awesome guys. Rock on.